Hello, and thank you for taking the time to watch this DVD. At your next appointment, I'm going to go review my report of findings with your case. At this visit, I'm going to go over a lot of information to help you understand what I found. So I want to pre-frame the appointment to get you the most, to help you get the most out of it. So the first thing I'm going to cover are my findings from the initial consultation. Uh, the things that you told me, the information, the labs that you may have given me, and the questionnaires that we filled out. During this time, I'll be outlining the foundational functional problems I'm seeing with your health. This is important to understand because it's unique to the way I practice. The systems that I'm going to point out to you may seem unrelated to your main complaints. To give you an example, if you come to me with a thyroid problem, I may, I may find a problem in your gastrointestinal system. Now you may not have any gastrointestinal symptoms that you're aware of, but this could be very critical towards your thyroid health. You see, 20% of your T4, which is a hormone that your thyroid makes, gets converted to T3, which is a hormone that your body utilizes. 20% um, of this conversion takes place from the healthy bacteria in the GI tract. So you can have a 20% decreased thyroid function due to a GI issue that you didn't even know you had. The only way that I can fix your thyroid is to get your GI system fixed. And this is just an example. You know, we could use diabetes or weight loss or autoimmune issues, but uh, the point is that you have to treat the body and the person as a whole, not just individual systems. So at this point, I will point out uh, the systems that I see are dysfunctional with your particular case. And be assured that these systems are related to your chief complaint in some way. You have to treat the whole person, not just the symptoms. So this is important because in our current system, your gastrointestinal doctor is not going to be treating your thyroid and your endocrinologist isn't going to treat your gut. And that's why the system is too specialized and we're missing the big picture. So after I review the information that we're going to look at on your blood work and see how this correlates with some of the other information we gathered. So the blood work that I'm going to be showing you has some colors on it to help you see the differences between functional ranges and conventional or pathological ranges that most other conventional doctors are using. It's important to understand that I'm looking at all the markers on your blood panel and how they interact with each other. So each marker is not necessarily as important as the patterns that I'm seeing. So at this visit, I'm going to explain the patterns that I'm seeing and what that means. So again, don't get too concerned with each individual marker. Also, understand that if I see something that requires immediate crisis intervention or uh, some type of referral, I'm going to make that recommendation for you. So this next point that I'm going to make is very important. I want you to come to this appointment prepared to take action. The financial aspect of your care is a big piece of that picture. I treat a broad variety of cases. Some are very complicated and some not so much. To give you an idea of what to expect cost-wise, on average, a case can range between uh, 2500 and 6500 So before you come to your next appointment, look at your finances and make up a plan. So again, come prepared uh, with that expectation. I do case fees. This means that I will give you one price for your case. This price includes everything that you need to complete your case. All the office visits, educational materials, uh, supplements, follow-up labs, email support, phone consultations, uh, whatever it takes to get you through the first part of your care. I do this so that you know what you're getting into before we start. Some cases can take as long as 12 months to get everything resolved and some less. So I like to break it up into three month increments. The plan I give you will be for the first three months. At your next visit, we're gonna make some life changing decisions. I can't stress enough the importance of coming prepared to take action. I've seen hundreds of patients and people go through this process unprepared. I see it as a fork in your life path. This is the path you're on. The biggest predictor of your future is your past. It's easy to continue to do what you've always done, and it takes effort and courage to change that course. When you come to your next appointment, you're going to be faced with an opportunity. The path that you choose will predict your future. You came to my office looking to improve the quality of your life. If I feel I can help you and you follow my recommendations, 
we are going to change your life. My experience shows me that if we are going to change your path and improve your life, you need to take action at this next visit. So this is the path that you're currently on right here. And at this point, you're going to be right about here. And we're going to give you the opportunity to change the direction of your path. So if you continue to go down this path that you've always been on, at some point, your know, momentum is going to make it easy to continue right past this and keep on going. It's going to be hard to make that break. And you'll go home and you'll think of lots of logical reasons why you, know, you need to think about this or you know, talk to your significant other or whatever the case may be. But the farther down this path you go, it's going to be harder to cross over to the next level or to the new path. So if you make this change right here, then that makes it very easy. So my advice is you is to get what you want to bring your spouse at this next appointment and think about it before you get to that fork. The further down the road you go, remember the harder it is to cross over. So please don't make the mistake that I'm pressuring you in any way. This is not about me. I'm going to be fine financially and health wise. This is about you. I truly want what is best for you. I don't want you to be a patient if you don't see the value. I don't want you to be a patient if this isn't financially obtainable for you. I don't want you to be a patient if you're not ready to make lifestyle changes. I only want patients who are seeking what I have to offer. I only want patients that know that I can help them. My job is to improve people's lives. And when I improve their life, it actually improves my life. That's my motivation. I believe that my care can not only help people achieve their goals, but more importantly, prevent further diseases or future diseases from developing in the first place. The functional problems that I find are the seeds of heart attacks, autoimmune diseases, cancer, and just about any other major health crisis that you can think of. Our current health care is about disease treatment and crisis care. Our current doctors are experts at drug and surgical treatments. The system is great for emergency care and managing symptoms with drugs, but the system fails with chronic conditions, and the system fails with actually getting people healthy. My mission is to change that, and that's my motivation. I'm looking forward to your next report of findings. I truly hope that you will be my next successful patient. But I want you to know that if I don't accept your case, it doesn't mean that there's nothing that can be done. I've had patients come to me who are told by some other doctor that there is nothing that can be done. Then, they, then I was able to help them. So either I'm a miracle worker or that doctor didn't know everything. So any doctor that tells you there's nothing that can be done assumes that they know everything. I'll never tell you that there's nothing that can be done. Just nothing that I know of. So if I don't accept your case, keep looking. Don't give up. Just like those patients who were told by that other doctor and then I was able to help them. If they gave up, they would have never found me. So I'm glad you watched this DVD and I hope that it helped you prepare for your report of findings. See you at the office. Hi, my name is Andrea and I have been sick for a long time. I've gone to several doctors and they would take my blood work and everything came back fine but I still was feeling sick. I couldn't really pinpoint what was going on with me. I couldn't tell you my foot hurts, my head hurts. I just felt sick. It was difficult for me to put one foot in front of the other in the morning when I got up out of bed. Some mornings, most mornings actually that happened. And I would continuously go to the doctor and um, they would do more blood work, everything came back fine, but I was still sick. I was beginning to think, okay, maybe I'm crazy, that made me feel that way at least. So I came in to Dr. Scott and told him what was going on with me, and it was a relief to finally find someone that knew what I was talking about. He, ex he knew all my symptoms, the bloating, the fatigue that I was having. Um, Direct told, advised me about the new program that he was um, offering to his patients, 
and I was willing to do it. I was just sick of being sick at that point, so I was going to try anything. And um, he told me he knew what I was talking about, directed me, got blood work done, and I did the program. It was difficult at first to give up all the food, but I did it, follow step by step as directed, and I'm feeling great. I feel great now, and I would recommend this to anyone. The Total Health Center, you will get the support you need, and again, I feel fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Carol. Hi, I'm Carolyn, and um, I discovered um, Dr. Scott, um, the ad in the newspaper, and I was very impressed and very curious, so I made an appointment, came to the class first, the little um, lecture thing, and decided that mm, maybe this is for me because I've really, really been struggling with trying to lose some weight, and um, didn't realize I was a little bit unhealthy, um, but Dr. Scott did his labs and discovered that I did have some little deficiencies and problems, so he He's uh, put me on the appropriate diets as we've gone along, and without even trying, I've lost probably 16, 17 pounds over just a couple of a couple, uh, period of a couple of months, and I'm very happy with that. And um, also, I feel very good, and um, I sleep better. My moods have been better, and I just generally feel better. So I know what we're doing is really working and helping me, and I'm just eager to continue and do whatever Dr. Scott advised me to do because it definitely is working and I would advise anyone who's struggling with weight loss or even just not feeling quite well um, or even um, different um, conditions or diseases he can help you with all of that I feel I truly truly trust him and uh, am very happy with the results so far and want to continue thank you thank you hi my name is Beth and I'm here to talk about uh, what I've gone through so far with dr. Scott in terms of uh, natural treatments to, um, for some health issues I've been having. So in the past, what I've kind of had a lot of stomach issues since like 2008 and um, couldn't really figure out, gone to some digestive and liver doctors, um, have been through a series of tests, endoscopy, and really just um, um, was given a lot of medication to try to fix what the problems were. And while they might have helped a little bit, um, it wasn't something that I wanted to stay on for a long time. So uh, I came to Dr. Scott. There were some other issues with my heart. I've been to cardiologist, so I've had some irregular heartbeats um, and just overall uh, not feeling well, some dizziness and, and so forth. So now, um, after having come to Dr. Scott, I've been through the repair vite diet for 30 days now. Um, so far, the stomach problems have completely gone away. So I've stopped all the medication that I've gotten from the digestive and liver doctors. Um, as far as uh, dizziness, I think, you know, from no caffeine and such, uh, I, I haven't really encountered any dizziness. I have a lot more clarity in thinking and just feel better overall um, health-wise uh, from the digestive system and just in general. So uh, I feel a lot better so far just after 30 days of that diet. So now we start the next phase. Awesome. Go. Hi, I'm Cheryl Johnson. Um, it's my problems, my health problems started about three years ago and uh, every, it seemed like everything I ate, my stomach just bloated up to the point where I almost looked like I was six months pregnant, it was awful. And I got frustrated so I got started going to see, the, uh, I went to five different GI doctors and I went out to a doctor all the way out, a GI doctor all the way out in uh, UVA and they all said the same thing. They all went through the numerous tests, the upper GI, lower GI, colonoscopy, Whatever test they could do, they did, and basically they came up with either I'm anorexic um, or I, um, I need a feeding tube in my body or I needed a pacemaker and or I could live with an IV. And I've never heard of a pacemaker in my stomach before, and of course I got nervous. Um, and, but they wouldn't do it to me anyways because I was too young, so they just said I had to deal with my health problems. And I got very frustrated, and my boyfriend referred me to an ad that was in the paper. Um, so I went to go see Dr. Scott, and I sat through one of his lectures, and I was just amazed at how much he knew and a different direction in which he went than my other doctors. So I was quite intrigued. So I set an appointment, and through numerous, um, well, not numerous tests, but one blood test came back, and he knew exactly what the problem was. Um, and 
it's been about two months and I am eating phenomenally. Every time I go see Dr. Scott, he gives me some new information. He takes me step by step uh, and basically heals me in a natural way. And the transition has been amazing. Um, I've gained 10 pounds. Um, I'm a lot healthier. And um, I'm still learning every day I come in. I'm still learning um, something new from Dr. Scott every day. I'm starting to lift again. Um, I, I was actually going to be in a figure competition. I had to quit because my health problem came up. And Dr. Scott just saved my life. So, thank you.